lunch break. We are so excited to see you guys. Today, we were thinking we can play a game of hide and seek. Girl, hide and seek is my favorite game. Do you guys know how to play it? So all you need to do is get two other people and one person is gonna be the seeker and then the other two people are gonna hide. So in the beginning, to decide who's gonna be the seeker, you do this fun thing where you say, not it, not it. See, but you said it last. So she has to be the seeker and I get to hide. And she is gonna sit here and count to 10 really slowly and while I hide. And once she's done, she's gonna come find me. But if I'm really good at hiding, maybe she won't. All right, let's go. This was during the cold part of the day. And the man and his wife hid from God among the trees in the garden. But God called to the man. The Lord said, where are you? Wow. But why would Adam and Eve want to hide from God? Well, Adam and Eve did something that they were told not to do. So they sinned. And instead of going to God and telling him that they sinned, they hid from him. Oh. Yeah, I might do that too, because sometimes when you come and tell someone that you did something wrong, they get mad and angry at you. No, we don't want to hide from God though, Gabby. So you're saying when I come to God, he's not going to be all mad and angry at me? No, God's a loving and caring God. He just wants you to come to him with your sins so he can forgive you and love you. Wow, that makes me feel a lot better about coming to God. Yeah, we don't have to play hide and seek with God. That's awesome. Yes. Well, on that note, let's pray. Dear God, we just come to you today. We thank you that we don't have to hide from you, but we actually get to come to you with all of the things that happen in our life, even the messy things, even when we disobey or we get into a fight with our sibling or we say the wrong thing, but we get to come to you. We get to be honest and you're actually there wanting to love us and forgive us. And we thank you for that, for that love that you show us every day. And we pray that our week would be awesome and be blessed by you. In your name, amen. Amen. Have a great week, guys. Bye.